Welcome back to the channel everybody. So as I'm doing right now I'm just going for a cruise before I go home. It was a long week Take some me time So I figure I take you guys off the rip Hopefully the wind's not that bad now since it's getting cooler out, I am wearing a sweater. Last night I didn't. Sorry, not last night before I didn't. Uh, fortunately, it's that time of year. Today is the 31st. Well, as I'm filming this, it's the 31st of uh, August. So it's almost September. Literally within like an hour. And that car right behind me there. And we're coming into the, into the fall season which I don't think anybody wants that means within till the snow falls uh, maybe two and a half months more and that sucks but it is what it is so the topic <coughs> The uh, documentary, the small documentary that I was, I'm working on, still is not complete yet. I got all my footage, I would walk around at night. The only thing I didn't do, like I said before, is the uh, interviews. So again, once we get all the guys together and it doesn't collide with our schedules, we'll get that done. I'm hopefully, I'm hoping before November we're done, but Let's see what happens with that. <clears throat> they got a transport behind me. My lens is fogging up. This is cold out, cool outside, and my breath is warm. I crack this open and get some airflow in here. Okay, he's gone. Hey, anybody want a hat? What do we have here? Oh, trail riders. In a bad spot to be parked, I guess, eh? Oh, you shitting me. So we got a train going by. <coughs> So right now I just turned off my uh, low beams. So while that train's going by, so here is the uh, high beams on my light pods I have on my fenders. Here's the actual low beams. Here's the actual high beams. Even if my uh, actual lighting off is pretty bright, it's perfect for the streets. Oh, there's a small train, okay. You loose gravel, man. Okay, so <coughs> I suppose this is a via train. Maybe this half cocked. Okay, so I was coming home. Uh, I think it was a Monday night. I actually uh, came up upon it came up upon a pretty bad collision. Yeah, blah 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 blah. Uh, What I hate about this time of year is freak man, like everything's fucking up. I can't see shit. I don't want to blow it down because I'll be blowing into my damn mic. So, I'm just going to take a ride through the town and I'm going to ride down to the Civic Complex. All right, back home. Not really the person to do, to do riding at night. Normally I just get off work and I go straight home, right? So. <clears throat> so I'll take all the side streets there. You should be pretty quiet tonight. There's a Thursday night, so. I 
Give him a little lady pick up some speed. Man, I hate having other cars behind me. And we're good to go here. Stupid brake caliper again. If you can't hear me coming. <laughs> I'm gonna have to figure out how to do something about that. Might have to take off the actual pad itself and give it a bit of a sanding. I'm pretty I'm pretty much convinced the freaking whole uh Actual cal not the caliper, but the actual disc itself is probably warped. That's quiet now. Oh, don't look at that. So if uh, if you hear a bit of wind or the audio is just weird a bit, I'll try to talk a bit louder. I have to leave my lens open a bit because if I don't, it's just going to fog up. So right now I'm actually heading down to the civic complex. So we're just gonna take a bit of a little ride tonight before I go home. Let me show you guys what it looks like at night. If I see or hear anything sketchy, I'm out of fucking dodge. Oh, shut up already. The other day I was leaving work. <laughs> I forgot I had my disc lock on. Well, need to say, I thought I broke my caliper, but I didn't. Those things work good. <laughs> yeah, I gotta figure out what's wrong with that tomorrow. Ooh, someone's leaking something. I heard him before I seen him. I'm in the little diamond, why is it not turning? <laughs> Normally if you sit in the diamond actually it turns it, why is it not turning? There we go. And make sure all these guys stop first. Too many times I saw that at a stoplight and watched people just roll right through a red. I mean, the streets are pretty quiet at night, so I figured tonight I just go for a rip. This is really hard to enjoy yourself when it's freaking uh, like 30 degrees out and it's humid as hell. That's why I'm more of an early spring, late fall, early fall guy type of guy. I'm not a fan of snow, if it was. I'll go down this street here. Turn on my high beams. This guy stopped there, I think. Can't really tell. This is also gonna really pay attention to because I don't want to, want to be a bit of a dink and I can get pulled over. I'll go down this side of the street. Yeah, these light pods where I put them are perfect. I don't even need to put my actual uh, lights on. Oh, 
elevators go down through the Pacific complex. Ah, shit, we're on the street. Yeah, I got to do something with that squeal. Man, I'm just gonna pick the street again. What do I do? Like, there's nobody around. Okay, it's turning already. That was quick. Come on, there we go. That's what I mean about this town being very quiet at night. The only time it does that, it gets really damp out. It's so annoying. I'll have a look at that tomorrow. Look at all the lights going on now. Trying to be quiet as much as you possibly can with this stupid caliper in front, man. I'm gonna lock this at 37. Come on, there we go. This ugh, is so annoying. Of course, it's cold, so it doesn't help any. Don't want to go down there, it's too dark. Let's go down here. Yeah, I'm not used to coming down here at night. I haven't been out in the street like down here since I was a kid. At least live in a house in the corner over here. Open, so I need to see what I'm doing. Different place at night. And of course, parking lots always lit up around here. That caliper, that's bad. I'm not gonna bother to turn the camera off, I'm just gonna leave it on because it is nighttime. I'd rather have the footage of this something does happen. Okay, where the hell is that stupid caliper? It sounds like it's on this side. Yeah, it's not on this side. We gotta check that tomorrow. Nothing seems loose. 
scalper is all good. Do you guys have any tricks or anything, or you think what the, if you know what the problem is, let me know what it is in the comment section. This one here is tight. <sighs> yeah, this one's loose a bit. <sighs> yeah, this physics kind of a wiggle to it. I'm going to tighten that in the morning. <coughs> well, yeah, so yeah, this is what the bike looks like at night. <laughs> There's a lot of heads. that one side. How to deal with that in the morning. Not right now. So let's go down to where we normally go. See I have the blackout mod on this thing so my tail is always on but it won't actually uh, flash until I actually hit the front brake. So since I'm here, back here, I'm good, so... Bring that down a bit more. This is what it looks like back here. If you guys see something in my camera that I don't see, this is quite possible. Because at night I'm mostly concentrating on what's in front of me, right? Oh no, water. You. Oh, jeez, man. So I did hit over a thousand clicks on this. See, uh, what the park looks like at night. Yeah, they had arts in the park down here all, all of August, and of course, because my work schedule work afternoons, I couldn't come down. I was actually quite upset about that. Well, I've lived in this town all my life and I barely even come down for any kind of activity they have going on here. Because A, they don't post, well, they do post it. The time I see it, I forget about it, or I'm just working. I like to do more in the park here. Like I, love, I love coming down here as a kid. This used to be Don Cherry's when I was fucking uh, growing up. And now I don't know what it is. I don't think it's anything anymore. You know, the Civic Complex was built in the 80s. I don't know if it was like what year. I'll have to look that up. I would love to go in there and just walk around and talk to you guys, but. I don't know if I'm allowed to actually, even though it's public property. Pretty sure I am. People camping for a night. How many of you guys can just scream? Look at the, like, look how bad this is, man. Look at this. Like, I didn't even know where to drive. So, so many friggin' holes in this place, man. And their theory is, so I'll just patch it up. <laughs> like. This is there's nobody around, I'm not going to bother using my turn signals. There's one way on. First gear. First gear, gear usually brings me up to 32 kilometers an hour. Nope, not happening. Well, let's go to here. Literally no cars coming.
I'm gonna just go up here and I'm gonna head home because I'm getting hungry. Higher gear. Plan on going. Plan on going riding this because it's really nice. It's gonna be really nice out. I'm gonna go down this little side street. One away the street, so I can literally just drive in the middle. Try to avoid using the front brakes as possible, so I can look at them tomorrow. On my way into work, I heard I, I think I ran over a rock. And I heard this big, big giant thong. I, I knew it was always a rock, but. It scared the crap out of me. Oh, Jesus, man. I'm going to bring down the first. Drop. Back down to my light pods. There's more, there's more plenty of light. These roads are so freaking bumpy over here. First gear is literally all I need. So there you go guys. Does us a little rip through my town after work. I feel a bit better, a bit de-stressed. That's where I love my bikes. So I'm gonna leave the video off there guys. Have yourself a great night. Take care. I'll see you in the next video. And remember, life is short, don't stop, keep going, and take that adventure. See you guys in the next video.